Hey, you guys! What's up? This is that brown bat back once again for an update here for all of you that are interested in the uh, the toy box limit. If you remember in the, uh, the the toy box limit episode that I did, uh, I just made the uh, file the toy box stats underscore limits dot lua uh, inactive and. Uh, and hey, shout outs to Infiniteer Adventures because that guy featured me on his channel. So anyway, that's pretty cool. Uh, anyway, I was a little excited about that, you know. He, he sent me an email and, uh, and uh, anyway, uh, it was pretty neat. So remember what happened when I deactivated it. It just, you're kind of running blind. You don't know when the toy box is going to limit out. And so you're basing it on a glitch. So you could potentially run into a wall. So I just figured since I was safely able to put down 24, remember I put down 26 ATSDs, I removed two to get rid of the glitches. So we had 24 in there. So I consider that to be the, uh, the limit. So I, I tried it with just doubling the numbers by open up this little file. This is what's actually in there. So I doubled all the numbers. And if you watch the highlighted ones, I think these are the ones that need to be doubled, but nevertheless, I doubled everything. And the max I was able to get in, the toy box was 20 instead of 10. So that's 10 times two is what? 20. So I doubled it. So 24, well, let me show you here. No, you know what? I'm just gonna show you this. All right, so 24. 24 uh, divided by 10 is going to be 2.4. So if I multiply everything in here by 2.4, that should allow me to get 24 ATSDs with no glitches. And the memory meter will work. That's the thing. The memory meter will work. So I'm going to do the math and I'm going to replace all these numbers. Everything by 2. What do I do? How to use Excel? Excel has math in it, and I don't have to do one by one. I can just drag everything down there. So I can just paste all the numbers on the Excel sheet. Why is it doing that? Thank you. It is now a number. And everything is going to be multiplied by 2.4. That times 2.4. I'm just going to do that. And those are the new figures. And I'm going to do the same thing over here. Okay, so those are the new numbers to the right. Alright, so I want to back this file up in case I mess it up. <laughs> Alright, and as we always do rename it BK because we like some Burger King, right? BK. Yes. Alright, so we should be in that. Yes. If I change it in here, it's going to save it. And that. Alright, so. Oh, you know what? This has the multiplication. Holy. I, I was thinking, I'll just copy and paste. That's not going to work that way. All right, so make these round numbers. Okay, same with these. All right, five, six, three, seven, one, four. I'm gonna do these little by little. Oh, five, six, three, seven, one, four, four, five, eight. Two, three, three, one, two, five, three. 
316, 480. Shout out to the people that can actually read really quick the numbers in their thousands and tens and a hundred spots. <laughs> 480, 1, 2, 3, you know, 480,000. My mind's just working as, you know, three zeros and, and stuff like that. Network, it's 24, so nine. Ooh. What did I miss? I missed this one. See what happens when you joke? joke around you mess up uh, 480 no that's right I don't know I forgot something originally there we go I don't know what I skipped over but nevertheless we caught it in time five seven six hundred all right now the three over there I have 38 I think these three numbers right here are just reference numbers but nevertheless we're doing it save okay so now let's load up a toy box we should be able to get 24 in there because of math you know what unfiltered would that give me take me right to it all right one now look the memory meter is working because well I told it to work basically that's what we did so what do we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. All right, so now that's the limit because we told that to be the limit. So I'm just looking for any graphical glitch errors because last time we got 24 in there. We got, I mean, it went to 26 and that was the capability of the toy box. And I don't see any gla gra uh, the gla yeah. I don't see any graphical uh, GPU glitches. So we're good to go. The memory meter is telling me that's it. So now if you have a faster computer than, than this, I don't know if you're going to be able to use, uh, put more stuff in there or not. But I wanted this for a meter. So when I go into a big world that I'm making, that Castlevania one, which I'm going to probably redo one day. So now we can actually see what the overrided limit is and how much more space I have. All right, how much more space? Look at that. Look at that. All right. So it's working. Um. And uh, yeah. So. Okay, I, I seen that yellow line down there. I'm like, no, no graphic glitches. It's not. It's the, it's the path creator that I that has the bridge in there. So, yeah. So, like, comment, subscribe, and tell all your friends that Disney Infinity is alive and well. Remember, keep on building.